The University of Chicago Booth School of Business, or Chicago Booth, or even just Booth, as it's often called, is known to be the MBA program with the most flexibility and a deep bench of Nobel Prize winning faculty. So do you need to be a future Nobel to get into Chicago Booth? Not quite. Hi, I'm Jeremy Scheinwald, founder of MBA Mission. And over the last 20 years, we've helped thousands of applicants get into top MBA programs, including Chicago Booth, of course. In this video, I'll discuss five things that can help you stand out. Be sure to stick around until the end of the video, where we'll share some resources to help you apply to Booth. Okay, let's get started. First, before applying, you should understand the Chicago approach, the core academic philosophy that defines the educational experience at Booth. The Chicago approach is all about teaching you how to think. It's a multidisciplinary framework grounded in theory and data that teaches you how to turn any challenge into an opportunity. So, as you build your application strategy for Booth, think about examples that illustrate your curiosity, deep thinking, and creativity, and show that you're someone who enjoys lively discussion about complex problems. Also, be prepared to show how you're comfortable working with data through your transcripts, test scores, and resume bullets. And if your quant grades and scores aren't quite the strongest, show awareness of that gap, write the optional essay to reveal how your strengths, wherever possible, are you know, in a position to help you compensate, and also emphasize your excitement about using the Booth curriculum to become a more data-savvy professional. Our second tip for Booth is to understand what flexibility really means. Don't just throw it around as a buzzword. At some schools, you might have a full year-long mandatory core curriculum. At Chicago Booth, it's not like that. There's only one common course, the LEAD course. So starting from day one, you'll have the academic freedom to design your own path. You'll be able to pursue topics that genuinely interest you and take academic risks. So in the Why Booth essay, again, stay away from those buzzwords and show the admissions committee how the flexibility suits you, how you'll use it to your advantage. One Booth student used an apt metaphor for the curriculum, telling us that Booth is an all-you-can-eat buffet. So think about how you can demonstrate what you would do with the staggering number of choices you'll get at Booth. Which, which skills will you need to develop? What resources are best suited to developing those skills? Booth offers 13 concentrations, and many students pursue three or four of them. So think about how you can work across disciplines to achieve your goals. You might pair a concentration in strategic management with one in business analytics or opt for a concentration in marketing management with a side of international business. Use that first essay to show you a strong personal direction that will guide your choices at Booth. This brings us to our third tip. As you articulate your career goals in that first essay, think beyond the many Nobels and Booth's strength in analytical finance. In short, do not fall into the trap of thinking your goals must be finance related to apply to Booth. Yes, Booth has a long tradition of excelling in finance, but Booth has so much more to offer. In the latest full-time employment report, over 50% of the class went into consulting and technology, and the four biggest employers, which hired about a third of the class, were the three MBB firms and Amazon. Booth also hosts some of the most prestigious entrepreneurship competitions, the New Venture Challenge and the Social New Venture Challenge. Booth even has a strong marketing program, the area that its crosstown rival is so well known for. So this is not to say you shouldn't have finance schools, you certainly can. But Booth encourages academic freedom and risk taking. So if you wanna pursue finance at Booth, consider how you'll pair your finance studies with other areas at Booth, like entrepreneurship or behavioral science. And if you don't wanna pursue finance, then you shouldn't feel like you have to include finance in your goals. Just share your goals and back them up with the resources that Booth offers. To navigate Booth, you must have a strong sense of self-awareness. In the second essay, use this opportunity to tell us something about who you are. Booth wants to learn about how your values manifest beyond the office. For this essay, consider examples that reveal your true character or show times where you're independent, either thinking about something differently or pursuing something that mattered more to you than others. The Chicago Booth approach also values diverse perspectives, so don't be afraid to share unique experiences or traits. Don't be afraid to stand out. Also, this through this essay, you ideally want to show how you'll continue your personal growth at Booth, and you may even want to show how you can leverage your individuality to impact others. 
With a highly student-driven culture and an emphasis on paying it forward, you'll again find a smorgasbord of community opportunities at Booth. Depending on your passions and interests, that could be teaching first-year students in the lead course, serving as an admissions fellow, advising the dean on marketing initiatives, or leading the popular annual ski trip. Doesn't matter. Just make it count. Lastly, our final thing to focus on for Booth is to show passion for Booth itself. A lesser known fact about Booth is that it has an impressive art collection. One of these pieces is a light installation that asks, why are you here and not somewhere else? What a powerful question to consider as you apply to Booth. So, how can you show that you only want to be at Booth? Beyond research in the courses, professors, student clubs, and employment reports, let's make a genuine effort to engage with Booth. If you can't visit campus, then you should sign up for virtual events, take a tour, read the Booth Experience blog, or watch a masterclass taught by a Booth professor. You can also use Booth's website to connect with a student and filter based on their pre-MBA background, career interests, or unique experiences. Use these specific conversations and your research to infuse your essays and your interview later on with your passion for Booth. If you're interested in applying to Booth, I encourage you to download our free insider's guide that goes in depth on Booth in terms of academics, culture, and community, as well as first-hand information from alumni, admissions directors, current students, and our own admissions consultants. We would also really love to speak with you about your application and give you a chance to learn for yourself why so many of our past clients rave about us online. Click the link below to sign up for your free 30-minute consultation with one of our admissions experts. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, if you enjoyed this video and want to get more MBA admissions and application tips, don't forget to like it and to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Best of luck with your applications.